understanding jump ship an idiom explained hello everyone today we're diving into a very interesting english phrase jump ship whether you're a language enthusiast or learning english as a second language understanding idioms like this can add color and depth to your communication so let's set sail into the world of idiomatic expressions Jump ship is an idiom that originally comes from a very literal action, leaving a ship during a voyage, often without permission or in a secretive manner. However, in modern usage, it has a more figurative meaning. It generally refers to leaving a situation, organization, or activity suddenly or unexpectedly, especially when it becomes difficult or unmanageable. It's often used in the context of abandoning responsibilities or escaping a challenging scenario. The phrase jump ship has its roots in maritime language. Historically, sailors who were unhappy with their conditions or who saw better opportunities elsewhere might literally jump off their ship and swim to another or to shore. This act was often seen as desertion. Over time, the phrase evolved to take on a metaphorical meaning, used in various contexts beyond the nautical world. To understand jump ship better, let's look at some examples. 1. In a work scenario, after realizing the startup was not going to succeed, several employees decided to jump ship and look for other jobs. 2. In relationships, when things started to get serious, he got scared and jumped ship. 3. In sports, fans accuse the player of jumping ship to a rival team for a higher salary. These examples show how jump ship can be used in different situations to indicate leaving or abandoning something. Remember, jump ship is best used in informal contexts. It's perfect for casual conversations or in a colloquial narrative style but might be inappropriate in very formal or serious discussions. Also, it usually carries a negative connotation, implying a hasty or irresponsible departure. And that's a wrap on the phrase, jump ship. I hope this video helps you understand and use this idiom confidently in your conversations. English is a language rich with such expressions, and mastering them can truly make you sound like a native speaker. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.